Yo, it's your boy EJ. Welcome back to another video. <laughs> All right, so I'm out here this afternoon with the pups. Um, gonna get one of them ready to go because he leaves either tonight or in the morning with, um, he leaves with Niagara. So her son and Niagara are heading back north. We're heading to north. She's heading back. This is his first time up there. And then also a little run run is leaving soon too. She's heading to Tennessee, Memphis, Tennessee. So I just want to show you guys He's heading back, he, or he's heading north. I don't know what she's gonna call him. Anything like that. They're just water on his back. This is a little runt runt right there. Beautiful try, beautiful girl. I got a feeling she's gonna pop a little bit later, but you see the size difference. So I took the tape off their ears. I gotta clean their ears. I will take them to go with their ears clean, but I've got enough experience to, to know how to do it. Get a little, um, a little wet rag and put a little antibiotic ointment on it. It'll be fine. Just want to show you all the puppies, man. I do have four males available. Um, these three, one, two, three are males. This is a female right here. One of these couple of these are males too. But most of these are females on this side. Like this is a male right here. For sure, I can tell that's a male. Uh, the one to the left, she's a female right there. That's the one that was pink. And they back there eating right now. I got the, um, the trays, one for food, one for water. After they eat, I fill them both over water so they have water throughout the day. But yeah, they just eating right now, y'all. That right there, that first one right there in the bowl, that's a boy as well. That's a girl right there. Man, these girls, I ain't gonna lie, these girls' colors are popping a lot more than the boys. I don't know why that is. But the colors on the girls are a lot more visible than the boys. Not saying it's gonna always be like that, but you know, it take up to 10 weeks or 12 weeks to see um, colors, the colors do change. But I'm just saying, as of now, the colors on the females are popping a lot more than the males. Right now, one of them is cleaning the other one ear, so that's what he was whining. So we got a hallway right there. These are some nice females, bro. Oh my God. Look at the female, man. Look at her, she's amazing. She is amazing. Yeah, I think that's pink. I think that's the one. It's either her or purple that I've um, that I've been considering keeping. And I think she's back there. Look at her. Oh yeah, just amazing, y'all. Amazing. Right now they're just eating right now. So yeah, I'm just uh, doing a little update video on the pups. I cleaned. Uh, all the kennels out this morning but you know how that shit goes you gotta do that shit at least three times a day morning afternoon and before bed so i gotta go through scrape out the kennels i sprayed them all down today too so it sucks that uh you know i gotta do it again but it's part of the, part of the process i have a male he's a howler he's very vocal um he is the largest one I don't know if I really want all that vocalization in my camp. So I might be selling the largest male. But there are four males available and they all look great. Um, deposit is $1,000. The full price on those males is $3,500 right now. As they get older, the price will rise as I start to see more of the colors, um, more of the characteristics. These dogs are very, very expensive dogs. If you look at the, if you want to do research on the blood I got, you try to find that similar blood, the price on those, on, on full tries starts at 5,500. Full tries, like what I got, start at 5,500 and go up. So the fact that I'm giving y'all this type of blood, these type of colors for $3,500 on the mills, it's an amazing price. I do have one female available. I don't know which one it is, but when I say they all are fire, I mean it. <laughs> 
They all are fire. These are all females right here. All three of these. These are all girls. And it's the only three females I got. Like one of them are sold, so it's it's only two available. This is a male right there. That's a male. With dirty butt. Yeah, that's a male right there. But those three that just ran up with female, that's a male back there eating too. Yeah, Roxy. It's crazy. Yeah, I'm just out here with the pups right now. Gonna get a uh, green cleaned up. Get them ready to go. I'm come back out here after I get this done. I'm gonna clean up all the other ones and move them inside. I move them back inside. They had enough yard space. And also I gotta come through here and clean up the shit that they accumulated inside the kennels. That's why you, it's not, that's why you shouldn't have dogs on grass and shit like that living on it because the shit gets smeared in. It's, it's harder to get up, you know what I'm saying? But I'm not really worried about it because I'm gonna move them um, back to the garage. And um, next time I bring them outside, I'm just going to run around the yard. Uh, and they're good dogs, man. Like, I don't really have no problems with them. I'm just running around, roaming around. Like, I'll let them out right now. Just let them get, get a little free time around the yard. They just uh, be biting my damn ankle. So. Just want to get out, play with his kids, do a gritty butt in there, still eating. <laughs> Katana want to get out. So Katana be like jumping over them and stepping on their heads and stuff like that. So I'm not gonna let her get out right now. As y'all hear, these dogs are very, very, very vocal. You touch their ears right now, they immediately whining and shit like that. So it's still one I gotta take tape off their ears. I thought I took them off all of them, but I guess I missed one. So I gotta get the tape off his ears. No, that's a boy, yeah. Got some air get to him. Gotta get that tape off the other one. Off his ears, man. You know that shit bothering him. Doesn't feel good, I know. It's a, sucker, it's a sucky feeling hurting your pups, but sometimes you gotta put them through a pain just to get them to the healing process. And that tape on their ears is preventing from healing the way that they need to. They need more, need more air to them. So all the tape off all their ears now. So the healing process should be a whole, whole lot better. He's out here with the pet right now. And then I can put some antibiotic ointment on their ears and they'll go from there. Let out Navy. Navy's a good, uh, typically he's really good with pups. I don't think today will be no different. You just gotta be a little bit careful when stepping on him. But 
shape because he's just a great, great, great dog. Watch out, watch out, Green. I don't get pissed on. Watch out, watch out, Green. I don't get pissed on. Damn, I'm fucking stepping in some ants, I guess. I mean, I'm gonna step in some ants, man. I'm just getting bit by a damn ant on my foot. This is what I like about Navy, man. Cause he'll go through and he'll lick all the ears and clean them up. These pups giving me a hard time right now, y'all. They biting on my foot, biting on my damn shoes. And I just got bit by a goddamn ant, so now my foot hurts. I gotta treat this grass again, y'all. Funny. I forgot my gate is open, so I gotta put Navy up or you realize the gate is open. Navy, let's go. Let's go. Good boy. Put him up before you realize the gate is open. And I'm not saying he's gonna run out and do nothing crazy, but what if there's another dog, what if somebody walking by with a dog and he see it and next thing you know. I got a problem with my hand, so. So let me, uh. Get my pack, y'all. I gotta go inside, get some, uh, my antibiotic spray. And get these ears all sprayed up. Man, get these dogs back inside. Maybe they'll follow me to the front. Get them back in uh back in that box. Get them back in the box with fresh wood shaving. And they can sleep inside. I gotta clean this uh clean them back kennels up before I let them back back there. So I gotta they should have they should have pretty good. None of them will follow me. So let them enjoy the backyard. I do got some ant treatment, man. I just been spraying the ant pals as I see them. But I got a, I got a goddamn little thing you push over. Right there. Right there. Right there. I got that little thing. So I'm gonna divide these dolls up so they can get back in the box. Come on, white and blue. Let's go. You can go over here. There you go. You hang out with them. You, little Merle, Merle. You can go over them. Hang out with them. All right. And seal. This color right here is seal, y'all. People that don't know. You can go in there with them. So we got three, three, three. And we're gonna put the other dogs back in the box. Over here. Thank you. 
top of this. Dog is not crazy, man. I'm honestly surprised I don't see no dogs in the front yard. Like, ain't none of them. God oh, damn, the ants all in here too? Ain't none of them, uh, none of them came in. Got be, we, gotta, we gotta get the ants under control. Don't do nothing else. You gotta get the ants under control, man. I don't fuck with nothing that bite. You know y'all like, you talking about he don't fuck with nothing that bite, but he got all these damn dogs. I don't fuck with nothing else that bite. How about that? How about that? I know it's a wrong little video, man, but I know you guys can appreciate appreciate what I'm doing. careful with this box because what I have noticed is some of these dogs we figured out how to climb I know a couple days ago Couple days ago, uh, I was outside cleaning. And I kept having to put someone back in the box, and I was just like, "All right, dog." They didn't figure it out how to climb up. That's the problem. All right, get these ears cleaned up, y'all. Spray some little antibiotic ointment on it right now. And then when I get my bath, we can get rid of deep in there and clean them. And now I gotta take them back to the ones that ain't sold next week. I gotta take the other ones because they're here scrubbing. When I do that, I'm gonna take them to get rewrapped if need be. All right, y'all, I'm not finding my antibiotic on it. See my antibiotic wipes. Not what I'm looking for though. Looking for the spray. What you looking though? Oh, that's in here. First aid. First aid spray. Hopefully when I go outside here, some dogs in the front, but they made their way this way. They have it, they all still in the back. So I guess I'm gonna have to, one by one, grab one and bring them up here. I think once I grab one, the others will follow. Let's go! All they tails be so high, y'all. They just so confident. That's why they can do whatever they want. Look at them back here. Look at the pack. 
Let's go, Pat. Let's go. Let's go. I don't know if you're gonna walk past there. Alright y'all, I'll right, catch y'all on this video. Let me get these dogs to the front yard, man. I guess I gotta take them by hand, so I need this hand. If you like this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe for more videos, man. I will be dropping more videos, more content every single day. I drop multiple videos a day. So if you're new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And if you return, make sure you hit the like button. I really appreciate it. I'm getting my ankles towed up right now as we speak. And I'll catch you guys in the next video, man. Let me get these dogs, uh, let me get these puppies out to the garage. And so I can get them all cleaned up and get their ears all cleaned up. I might make another video tonight. It depends on how many likes I get in the video. If I get 200 likes, I'll drop another video today. Yeah, I've been kind of lacking on the likes. Told y'all I'll get my ankles bit up. Hey, y'all, come on. I need y'all to follow me. You can follow me right now. Let's go. 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 And that's where it stops. <laughs>